Hey guys, Ninja Master Fire here with my very first LEGO Ninjago 2016 set. This is Jay's Elemental Dragon. This is set 70602, comes with 350 pieces. The minifigures we get in this set are Jay, Siren, and Monkey Wrench. So let's look at the back of the box. So this time we get the Jin Blade with Nia trapped inside. And we also get the new Skybound app game, which is on the App Store or Google Play, wherever you get your apps or games. Now, let's move on to Jay's Elemental Dragon itself. So, here is Jay's Elemental Dragon. I highly recommend this set. So, uh, now let's move on to the instruction manuals. We get two instruction manuals this time. The only advertisement in the first one is the back with the win with Lloyd. So, now let's move on. Well, the second manual has more. So we get right into the build. So here is the poster for the Ninjago 2016 Wave 1, the Sky Pirates. That's really nice. And we also get all of the LEGO Ninjago 2016 Wave 1 sets. And the Cole's Dragon review will be coming soon. And the join the Woo Crew on LEGO Ninja, Ninjago.com advertisement is also there too. And we also get the new app, the new game we just saw in the back. The Peace Count, and the LEGO Club advertisement if you want to join. It's on LEGO.com. So now let's move on to the minifigures. The two minifigures we get in this set are Jay and Siren. I'm going to be looking at these individually. So here is Jay's new suit. So he has his new Air Jitsu garb on. I'm just going to bring this minifigure up so you can see the uh, symbol, the lightning air jitsu symbol better. We, he also gets the leg piece from last year. It's the same thing and the same hood from last year too. But it's really cool how they did metallic blue and they, and they edged it with purple. That's really nice. And Jay also, does, Jay also gets the new scabbard with the two katanas in them. It holds two katanas in the same place. That's really nice. I really like that. Jay does get some of that blue metallic, the metallic blue and the metallic purple, the edging purple on the back of his torso too. I really like that. And no alternate face once again for Jay. We do get a new face for Jay in Misfortune's Keep, or he does get an alternate face only because he has the eye patch, which we'll see him. We'll see how he transforms to Pirate Jay in the series. So now let's move on to Siren. The Sky Pirate in this set is Siren, or. Siren. I'm just gonna call her Siren. So here's her torso and leg detailing and she does get the new pirate sword and gunmetal gray and on the back she does get the uh, Get the armor piece with well, it's not really armor, but it does hold swords and stuff And this is a dagger, but it's really just a short sword and then sword and then in Jago will they just call this a dagger and She does get the new recolored black widow hair piece. It's r extremely useful Full, and as you can see a lot of stuff is hidden When you take all that stuff off you can see her back detailing kind of greenish because hold the swords in the show And she does get an alternate face more of a happy face than a mad face and here's a final look at her torso and leg detailing Oh, yeah monkey wrench is also in this set. He's one of the more key members of not crew So I'll just turn this around. He does get a wrench to fix up the uh, flyer that's also in the set. I will be showing that after Jay's Dragon. And these, and he also does get this cool harpoon launcher. I'm just going to shoot that right now. I'll probably cover it. Probably cover it. But with some more skill, I may even catch on to things. But I'm just going to shoot this right now. Right. Dude, just you, And you're never going to probably lose this stud piece right here. You're probably going to lose this because it may fall off. But it's always going to be attached to the chain. So you'll probably never lose it. So here's one final look at Monkey Wrench. He does come in Misfortune's Keep, which I probably will be reviewing this. Well, we'll be reviewing Misfortune's Keep soon, hopefully. So now let's move on to the actual dragon itself. So here it is, Jay's Elemental Dragon, and I really like this cool brick-built head. And I'm so glad they're keep they are gonna keep doing these heads and didn't come up with another one of those two-piece rubber heads for the head and the jaw, because this is really nice. And this is really interesting right here, how they use Metal Beard's Metal Beard from the Lego movie being recolored in dark blue and upside down. And I really hope they do this more with dragons. And you can see the orange eyes right over there. And if you're going to have one sticker on this set, you can take all the stickers off, but if you're going to have one in this set, 
use this one because this is really nice. I really like this one. And these are not stickers. These are actually printed. Yeah, these are printed. These are actually the same ones from the handle in Air Jitsu J, which I have reviewed with Air Jitsu Kai and Air Jitsu Moro. You can see that on the Ninjago 2015 playlist on my channel. So moving on from the head, there's the neck, which has the golden reins. Unfortunately, they do not give you, like, handles to hold on to the golden reins while Jay is not on the dragon. And here are the wings. They're kind of a letdown because you can only move them up and down. That's really the most accurate thing about these wings. You can bring them forward, not too much. You can bring them back. It's better to bring them up and back. That's to give them... Give, that's kind of really better. And here's the saddle where Jay does actually fit with both katanas in there. You may, because too frequently with Lego sets, you have to remove armor, weapons, even armor, wings with the Chima line because the eagles have to, you know, get in the seat. But he's actually sitting forward from the proper seat piece, but that's fine. As long as you can just hook him up to the reins, that's great. And. Here are the and here some flintlock piece flintlock pistols, well not flintlock the pirate but flintlock pistols, and yeah I can actually see the dart with the tiger widow venom in it. I'm sorry if it's really blurry, and you can also see the hole you're supposed to, and the legs are all the exact same build, and I'm so glad that Lego is to is not is way too is not too good at clashing things with some different colors to you know rebuild. To rebuild. Well, Lego's just good at making sure all the pieces are good without clashing into the dragon. So that's really nice. And here's the tail. You can curl it up. You get a lot of articulation with the tail. You can curl it up. You can bring it back right there. Well, not too much, but it it's more good if you curl it up because it's really nice. You can get a waving motion. So I think that's pretty much it for this dragon. Siren and Monkey Wrench get this flyer with the six stud shooters right here. And Monkey Wrench can actually fit right on this flag. And here's the cockpit for Siren. And it also has the white, the new pirate swords in white instead of gunmetal gray. You could actually use these for Monkey Wrench and Siren if you don't want them to use their regular weapons. And the six stud load shooter, I'm just going to shoot one because it just goes everywhere. There. But it just shoots rapidly. So that's a really nice flyer, and there's only one more thing in the set. The last thing in the set is the Sword of Souls, sometimes called the Jin Blade. And this time, Nia's trapped inside, expressing her water powers. And I'm surprised how Lego did, how Lego is doing really light with her water powers. Because you can just see it's almost clearish if it's not on the, uh, you can see it's kind of clearish. So, that's, I think that's pretty much it for this set. So, that's it for Jay's Elemental Dragon. Let me know what you think about this set in the comment section below. So, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you soon with more reviews on Ninjago sets. So, bye guys!